This is an explanation of the editing elements offset from edges. And basically what that is, is an offset function. And the offset function is, allows you to take edges and turn them into sketch lines off of solid models. And you can use that by sketching off of a plane, as long as you have a solid model within it, or if you have a face of a model that you want to use the edges from as well. And I'll show you right here. Here I have this 3D model, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to offset the edges and basically extract them and place them onto the model face itself. In order to do that, um, I have to be in part, part design workbench. And actually, I'm in the sketch right now, so let me back out, and I'm going to select this face right here, and I'm going to go ahead and select sketch. And now within sketch, I have to go to my operation flyout toolbar, which is right here. Um, I'll pull it out right there and show you. And here is the offset function. Um, if you don't see this, go ahead and right click in the right frame area and make sure that operation is selected as we see here so that it is active. You can also access it if you go to the insert and drop down to operation and then transformation and you'll find offset. Now to simply get it to activate go ahead and select the function and you'll have the option of either selecting these edges here or you can select the face. And if you notice when I have my cursor over the face, all the edges are highlighted. So I'm gonna go ahead and select it. And as I do, notice I'm not holding the left mouse button or anything, I'm just moving the mouse itself. And as I do, I can move the series of lines that I wanna create as a sketch, lines, uh, inboard or outboard of the original selection. And I'm gonna go ahead and click to define the distance of where I wanna place it. I did it arbitrarily, but you can always go in and actually select right on that particular value, or you can select on the line itself, double click, and you'll get the offset definition dialog box. This is the one you see over in the document. And here it's going to bring up your choices, uh, parallel corner type, sharp or round, that is how you want your corners. We have the object to offset, which is the face that we selected and then our value, which we can make a little more precise by either using the up or down buttons here, or we can actually click right in the box and place in a value. And we have an offset mode, either project and offset, or intersect and offset. And we have our propagation type, which is set right now at no propagation. This is the default that we'll just leave it at. Once you're kind of happy with this, go ahead and select OK. And notice that the lines are highlighted in yellow, that these are offset lines from the edges that we selected on this face. Now with these lines, what we can do is we can go ahead and exit out of our sketch. And we can now go ahead and either create a pocket, a pad, or anything else you want to do with those lines. And you can treat it just as a sketch. And you can see here in the specification tree that these lines are now a sketch. So let's go ahead and hit pad and take a look at which way we're going. I'm going to hit OK. And notice that we have now created a pad right here in the specification tree that's separate from the other pad. And all we did was basically just use the lines off of the lower pad. And that is basically what we're talking about within the editing elements offset from edges